Well, hello and how are you? Uh, I know it's been quite a while since I have done a long form video like this, uh, but I am slowly starting to make some changes to my YouTube channel and with all the new updates and ideas and things that I have in mind that I'd like to do with this channel over the next little while, uh, I thought I'd do this little update for all of my subscribers, however many that still watch, so that uh, you can have an idea of what it is I'm hoping to accomplish over the next several months. And maybe by doing this, I can also kind of hold myself accountable. Um, so I do appreciate you taking a few minutes out of your time just to watch this, and I'm hoping this is not going to be an overly long video. Uh, so as you can tell, I am pre-recording this video while I'm not doing a live. I've been doing a lot of lives lately, uh, but I'm hoping to start creating some structure to my channel. One of the things I'd like to do is to return to making pre-recorded and pre-edited long-form videos. I really like doing these, um, and I miss doing them. I'd like to come back to this. Uh, I'd like to do one at least once a week, if possible. Uh, I have the time now to put into it. Hopefully, I, I can keep that time and I'd like to start making use of it. This could mean doing uh, instructional videos or maybe just update videos on projects that I'm working on. Uh, it could be anything. I'm not going to have a formal structure to that. This isn't going to be a how-to channel. I think there's enough of those in existence and so many of them have been done by other artists over the last 10 years that it has uh, overflowed the YouTubes with content on how-to videos. And there's plenty still out there. But it really wasn't what I wanted to do because I felt like I was just kind of repeating the same things over and over again. And there's only so much you can do with the YouTube video, at least I feel anyways. Uh, but along with that, if people want to see more of that kind of thing and I feel like I want to put more time into it, I may start a Patreon. I won't start one that's terribly expensive, but we'll see how it goes. That's kind of in the future. That's a little bit down the road just yet. But... Definitely doing more uh, long-form videos at least once a week. Um, the big thing these days, uh, thanks to TikTok, is the short-form vertical videos that are a minute, two minutes, three minutes, what have you. Uh, it's, it's now in all the social media forms. Uh, thanks to TikTok, it's now on Instagram, is Reels, and YouTube has its shorts. But with YouTube, they can only be a minute. If they're not a minute, they fall under long-form videos. And YouTube has a terrible habit of stretching out those videos to over a minute. I've done a couple that have only been 58, 59 seconds uploaded to YouTube. They're a minute one, minute two. So they have to be actually under a minute in order to fall into, uh, into shorts. But I can do some really quick demos with those. And I'd like to see if I can do a couple of those a week and something that I can put through all the platforms. I am on Instagram, which I've always really enjoyed, and uh, I am on TikTok. I've just put a lot of stupid stuff up there, but I might start gearing that a little more towards making proper um, short videos on there so that I actually have a bit of a theme to that um, to that channel, is that what I would call it? To, to that account. <laughs> but when I make a video, I can upload the same video to all three. You'll see the same thing on TikTok. Uh, same thing on uh, Reels, on Instagram, and on Shorts here, as long as I can keep them under a minute. Uh, again, that's something I'm hoping to work towards over the next several months. And then the last thing it brings me to is lives. Uh, I really enjoy doing live streams. Uh, I am going to have to start making a few changes to that. Uh, the last few times I've been uh, joining some other artists online and just sitting and chatting for two, three, four hours with just general chat. I haven't kept them up uh, on my channel. I've switched them to private. They're not completely deleted. Uh, but I don't think anyone's going to sit through four hours. Uh, I'd like it to be a little more productive. So moving forward, I hate that term, but moving ahead with my channel, I'd like to structure my lives a little bit more. Uh, every third Wednesday, we have Art Block. Uh, I believe that's coming up. I don't think it's this Wednesday. I think it's the Wednesday after. I will make a post and I'll make a, uh, I will make a post and I'll remind everybody about that. Uh, but I do have Art Block every third Wednesday with uh, Enrique. Uh, and I'm hoping to add a one a week live stream, possibly twice. Uh, that is just sort of... Um, 
uh, a general open stream that people can come and join in. But I think I'm going to have to kind of restrict it two hours and less. Certainly people are welcome to join in. We can chit chat. Uh, but I'd like to kind of keep the, uh, the dialogue and the discussion, the activity a little more structured. Let's talk about things about art. Let's work on some art on the stream. Talk about what it is we're working on. Let's have a little more constructive uh, dialogue going on with those streams. Uh, as well, I have to moderate the content a little bit more. Uh, I am listed as an adult channel. I don't want this put under kids only. I want to keep this as an adult channel. Uh, I have had a couple of people on there who are under 18, but that is all right. Um, that doesn't really affect it that much as long as that we can keep things relatively clean. That goes for any kind of language and any kind of topic of discussion. Let's try and keep that a, a little more moderated. And yes, uh, I know you're watching. <laughs> and I know a certain individual who likes to participate. Uh, we have to kind of moderate a little bit, but um, uh, we want to keep you around. We want to keep uh, all our participants around, uh, but we just have to kind of keep, keep that tightened up a little bit. All right, um, so again, Restructuring uh, of the channel moving forward. I'd really like to see if I can gain some more subscribers. I've only got 150. I'd really like to aim for that thousand, if at all possible, this year. I don't know if it will be. I kind of doubt it, but I'm going to push for it anyways. So uh, regular long-form videos about once a week. Uh, one or two or three shorts, however many I can squeeze in, that'll go up per week. We'll see how that goes. I'm not sure how many that I can afford to do, but I'm going to work on that, see where I can go with that and uh, as well as live streams uh, along with Art Block every third Wednesday. Uh, I'll have once or twice a week uh, to have uh, two hour live streams where we can kind of actually sit with other artists, work, discuss art, and uh, ones that I feel better about leaving up on the channel. All right, so this is, um, this is kind of what I have in mind just in general. Uh, We'll see what happens as it goes forward, uh, what time allows for this, because this is going to be a good chunk of my life. It's going to take up quite a bit of time. I want this to be part of my life. Something else I should tack on here on the end is that I am participating in an anthology book that is part of the 100s, 100 Days of Comics. Uh, it was supposed to have started at the beginning of March, but we've kind of shifted it because we jumped onto it a little bit fast. And that is um, being organized by Adam Lore. Uh, who is a, a regular on this channel. That is something I will probably share the progress of on this channel as well. And I think that that would actually be uh, a nice kind of tie-in and something that I can work on on my long form videos as I can use that as part of my demos. So all I can do is wait and see at this point. I've got to get my uh, my foot to the, the grind, the pedal to, you know the phrase, I got to get my ass in gear. <laughs> I hope to see you all again very soon.